The story of San Carlo started back in 1992. My father opened his first restaurant on Temple Street in Birmingham and it literally became a success overnight. But he always wanted to come back to Manchester because Manchester was, was my father's home and it was all about for us creating this amazing atmosphere and there was nothing really that had that and had this kind of big wow factor when you walked in through the doors. People have always known San Carlo, they always say it's the atmosphere and the warmth of the place. And that's the people that we employ, they're the ones that create that. You know, anybody can pay for fixtures and fittings and design, it's got to be more than that. And I think we've just tried to really focus on those traditional classic values of what a restaurant is all about. We never wanted to be known as just another chain, you know, we're a family business, we're very passionate about what we do. And then we sat there and thought, where else can we go with it? And we had the idea of Cicchetti and create this more casual, um, small dishes. And I think at the time, small dishes were really starting to take off in London and it became um, a huge success for us. From there, we then took the concept to London. So, you know, we're in Piccadilly, we're in Covent Garden, St. Martin's Lane. That really has then spread the brand. And from there, it's now gone on to the Middle East as well. So we've opened Chiquetti's in um, Saudi, in Qatar, in Bahrain. It's become really, really popular. and essentially that is a brand that was born in Manchester. And it's not very often you have that, a brand that was born in Manchester and especially goes global. When I think about what Manchester was like 15 years ago, the city has transformed hugely. I've always loved Manchester, the warmth, the vibrancy of it, and I love the fact that Manchester's so forward thinking. You know, you can just see the progress, it's amazing. We've, we've focused on this city for many years and the city's been very good for us. And we hope, hope that we've contributed to the city as well. But uh, no, we'd, we'd love Manchester. Yeah.